Okay, so hey guys, how's it going? Today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to do or how to make a reset button, how to reset all your builds. So let's start off straight away. Anyway, you can I'm gonna give you the settings to start off with for the button. The top few don't really matter, it's mainly the channels at the bottom that matter. You can do the interaction radius however you want. But the channels at the bottom, I'd recommend using 30 for enable when receiving from and dis and disable when receiving from I'd say n use no channel and when interacted with transmit uh, transmit on use channel 1 Okay so what you what else you're going to need is you're going to need these explosive thingies I can't even remember what they're called but anyway you're going to have to use these settings Anyway, each one will be different. So the first one will have channel two, second one will have channel three, third one will have channel four, and so on. We'll be using eight different um, explosive um, items. But first one starts with channel two, last one ends off with channel nine. And yeah, I think that's pretty good. Anyway. Let's move on to, let's check the second one. I'll show you that's the same settings. Okay, so if we move down here, we have a sequencer just outside of the barrier blocks. I'm gonna show you the settings for the sequencer. We're going to do a normal length and we're just going to do width 5. The start sequence when receiving from has to be channel 1 for, it, for this to work. So then we are going to use... Oh, what are these called again? We're going to be using... We're going to be using the triggers. Now each this is for this is for each channel for the explosive devices. Yeah. I'm gonna show you the settings. The first one will obviously be channel two when triggered transmit on, but we'll have the transmit every X triggers um, for one. And then moving up a channel, the transmit every X triggers moves up by one and the when triggered transmit on moves up by another one and then we have the rest that carry on and do the same then we have the um, we have what is this called again we have the team settings and inventory I'll be showing you the settings for this And round and receiving from has to be channel 9. Let us start the game. Whoops. Okay. So, we don't need the weapons for now. We're just going to practice our 1v1s. We're just going to practice our 90s. What is that? Okay, and I'm gonna come down. I'm gonna click this button over here. And it will destroy everything around here. So, just before you guys leave, I'm gonna end the game real quick. And now that I've ended the game, remember I showed you the explosive items, so it'll go channel 2, channel 3, channel 4, channel 5. If there's must be explosive items on the other side, going channel 6, channel 7, channel 8, and channel 9. These will all have the same settings other than that channel. Otherwise, guys, hopefully this was exciting, and hopefully it helped you guys out with your 1v1 maps. 
Hope to see you in the next tutorial. And peace out.